We're at Hall's Pond in Brookline, Massachusetts. Hall's Pond is named for Minna Hall, one of the founding mothers of the Massachusetts Audubon Society. Minna Hall lived near this pond and she loved it and often came here to go bird watching. Minna Hall, with her cousin Harriet Hemingway, founded Massachusetts Audubon Society in 1896. Harriet had read an article about the hunting of birds, especially birds with very special feathers for the women's hat trade. It was very fashionable for high society women at that time to wear feathers in their hats. And she was appalled at the decimation of the birds for this. It's estimated that in one year alone, something like five million birds were killed for the hat trade. So Harriet Hemingway and her cousin Minna Hall decided they were gonna do something about this. And what they did was they contacted high society Boston Brahmin women, and they had them over to their houses for tea, and they persuaded them to stop wearing hats with feathers in them. And in the end, they got about 900 women to sign up for the Massachusetts Audubon Society to try to campaign against using birds' feathers in women's hats. They were very successful at this. After 1896, when they founded the Mass Audubon Society, a number of other state Audubon societies were founded, and these groups acted together to lobby Congress to pass legislation to protect birds. And in 1918, Congress passed the Migratory Bird Treaty Act, and this was the first act to really protect birds, and it was one of the first conservation acts in the United States. Minna Hall lived in this neighborhood. She lived on Ivy Street, just one street over from the pond, and she used to come here even up to her 90s to enjoy the marsh and the peace and quiet and the birds and the pond. And it's really lovely that we can still come here today to enjoy the same scene.